So today we uh, had a good goose hunt and we tried a little different decoy setup than we usually do. We went with the J hook. Uh, we'd been having trouble with birds flying off to one side or the other with our with our setups, and today we were going to have birds coming in from the coming in from the west, but the, they could have been potentially coming in from the south also. So what we did was we set up a J hook, created a line right here, put our decoys in it, and then right at the very end, on the north side of it, where we knew that the birds weren't going to come from, we just cupped it out just a little bit. And what happened was these birds just poured right over top and started landing right in this little right in this little uh, cup right here. And the only other thing that we did was we created a, we put three decoys out behind us and uh, we left them about 30 yards out so those birds could fly over top of and try to get in in front of those birds. We had two birds land right in those decoys and we had the rest of them come right over top. So, I mean, the birds worked perfectly for us today. Uh, we also know that those birds were in a little bit of a line. They were, they were, they were feeding in a line more than a, they were a, any sort of a use. So that also fed into that. But... Check out how these birds worked into this setup today. They're coming. Shoot him! Shoot it, Chris. That a boy. Nice shot. So next time you're out goose hunting, if the situation calls for it, try the J hook out. I hope you liked this video. If you did, hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, check out some of our other videos, and check out our website at weekendwoodsman.com. Thanks for watching.